All right, guys, for Kawaki, we actually have, and you can see it on the screen, we have a max combo of 45 damage. Do you know how much that is? That's an entire health bar. And just so you know, it's a very short combo. So if you ever catch someone without subs, you just almost automatically win the game with Kawaki. We're going to go over that later. Let's go over uh, a few other easier things first. So the first two hits ain't going to matter. The third hit, he throws these little kunai, and that actually gives you a really good stun. From here, we can do an ultimate. We can do a jutsu. We can jump out pill. We can jump out tag. We can jump out up item, for example. Just like that. Okay, so now the next thing is... I think that's the fourth hit where he has a knockback, or I'm sorry, a knockdown. And if you haven't watched my videos, a knockdown is where it basically knocks them to the ground like that. And you can hit them as uh, until they hit the ground. Well, once they hit the ground, no, you can't hit them anymore. But that gives you a long time. So essentially, you can do everything we just did. Um, <clears throat> some other cool stuff is you can kind of do some cool stuff with his jutsu. Um, another thing is with the knockdown though, you could just keep it going and you don't have to jump either. You could just stand there. Look at that. And just, just stop punching for a second and you can just keep hitting. And no, this is not the big combo that I was talking about because that takes too long right there. And then their subs might recharge and then they, they get out of it or their support characters could recharge and then they could get out of it that way. Really, the key is to do a lot of damage in the least amount of time as possible to give them the, the most likely chance for all the damage to be hit. Otherwise, they're going to have, you know, look at it. They got four subs. They got two um they got two support characters like all that could definitely help them break in, break them out of your combo so um anyways so let's see another thing we could do with this is we could do jutsus now this jutsu also has a knockdown i kind of like to jump out to be honest it kind of looks that looks cooler in my opinion you know what I'm saying, wouldn't you? Anyways. What if we do that? All right, wait, hold on. Let me go over what I just did. Um, so, essentially, do this, right? And then you switch and grab as well. So, I'm going to do it one more time. Let's do it with Boruto this time. Oh no. Okay, so he doesn't have a very long range grab, so that that's okay. We can still do it with Boruto. We just need to make sure that we're really close to our opponent whenever we do it. Let's go over that real quick. Just like that. All right. Now, let's see. So, now we know some things to do with the knockdown. Um, another thing is you could do your up item. You can do tag. You didn't have to jump out pill grab, but you could literally just, you know, you could just grab. If it makes it easier. You do more damage, though, if you jump out pill, though. Yeah. That is, that's another thing. His kit is amazing. Look at this. Like, you, you get your bomb, right? But you also have attack up pill. And you have a defense down tag. And this is going to really come in handy when we go over that big combo. Um, yeah, so, all right, let's go over the next one. So the next hit is going to be... Not that one. The next hit. There we go. Is a bounce. But look, he has a high rebound on this bounce. Which means that we probably are not going to be able to just jump up chakra dash and go into a juggle, right? And for you guys that don't know what juggles are, it's whenever you're... Hold on, I'll just show you. That's a juggle. Like, whenever you're hitting them in the air... Oh, 
without them hitting the ground. I mean, don't get me wrong, you can't do it that way because well, you just don't have that many tags online. So, but we'll go over a different way that you can do it. Um, that's just the simplest way. All right, let's see. So, <clears throat> whenever you have, I don't think this will work. No, that's too low. I don't think the beam will work. I don't think this will work. Okay, so you can't you can't do anything like that. You you can't do that. Oh God, I'm hitting the wrong button this one. I was like, what, what's going on? This is also too low. So we're gonna have to use either a shuriken, a tag, or a bomb. Now, a bomb's gonna hit him away. A shuriken doesn't have a long stun time. So let's use the tag so that way they get stung, stung for longer. All right, so we need to be closer. <clears throat> So let's go over that. Let's let's try to jump at him. Oh, look at that. And just like that, we learned how to juggle. Okay, cool. So now, so that's something that you could do there. Another thing is, let's go over the up combo. Uh, um, with that being at the end of the combo, there are things that we can do. Um, one, I, I want to try something real quick. I think I can. Okay, so a canceled. Can you not charge up a cancel dash? Like I thought you could. <clears throat> mm -mm, no, it's not letting me charge it. I was hoping if, if I could charge it, then I could uh, then I could double down on it. Hmm. But it's not letting me. Okay, so <clears throat> honestly, I wouldn't advise doing that combo. Uh, the down combo doesn't really have anything to work with, but, hold on, ooh, that last hit though, let's, let's double check that, one, two, three, alright, one more hit after that, nah, that, that's all, I think that's all together, okay, anyways, um, so that one's not gonna have anything, but the down combo has the most damage, I think, so the neutral and the up combo are about 18 damage. The down combo is like 20 and a half, I think. All right, so let's go over some um, more damage in, or the high damage combo, the one that I told you guys about. So I'm going to use Sarada. Then I'm going to use the down tag. And then I'm going to use the attack up pill. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the knockdown and we're going to jump up and use Sarada just like that right and that's essentially what's going to give us time to throw the tag and do the and do the down build. the problem is is when she does this you have to do the tag before he falls Okay, so that's gonna be that's gonna be the only thing. Now you could do it the way I just did, but that looks lame. Like I, I, I think it looks lame. So, what I like to do whenever I do it, that right there, I like to just jump out. It kind of looks cooler. Now watch the damage on this thing, though. Okay, I think forty-four on this one, and look at that health bar. It's almost an entire health bar of damage. That's a lot, guys. Like, I don't think I realize. Like, that is, that is a lot of damage uh, for one short combo. Look, look how long it takes me to do this combo. So, if, if he didn't have subs, right? Like, look, look how long this takes. So, whoops. Over. That's like what, maybe five seconds. And look at this. This is about forty-five damage, Four, forty-five and a half. Yeah, forty-five, thirty-three. There you go, dude. That is so much damage, like so much. As for uh, Kawaki's awakening, by the way, um, yeah, like it's it's good, it's good. Um, you get the same combos as if. As if you were, uh, <clears throat> as if you were normal. Let's go to practice menu. Let's do wind damage, so we don't have to break their guard. 
So you you have all the same combos. So yeah, right there on the knockdown, that's that's probably where I would hit him. I think I could have got that if I would have done it just a little faster. You could do it like that too. And then like once it hit, not before, because if you do it before, if you switch before, you see how he just he just leaves. So right whenever he does the damage and he's about to send him flying. Oh, oh, you know what? That was cool. Oh, so, I don't know if you guys noticed this. So it, if you notice, whenever I do this and I switch, it cancels it out. I bet there's so many combos to do with that for the fact that if you, ah, oh man, I would love to mess with that. Um, I kind of want to see what, ah, oh, man, there's so many combo ideas right now. Okay. So like, yeah, that, but anyways, you switch out and then, you, and then you can start hitting them again right whenever they go um i will be here forever if i try to figure out all the combos that you could do with with, with those because um yeah that, i'll just have to make a video later on that but um it's really cool anyways yeah thanks thank you guys for watching um i think that's gonna be it for kawaki today and if you guys have a character that you guys would like me to break down and, and look at a little bit please let me know um, cause I, I pretty much do them blindly at the moment and, and I'm a very small channel. So a like and subscribe would really help if you like the con uh, content. And then other than that, guys, I will see y'all in the next one later.